I'm Dana Roselli. Right now on your 13 Action News Update, we are waiting to gather new details on a deadly rollover crash. It happened this morning on northbound US 95 at mile marker 107. We don't know the details of the driver or what happened, but we'll update you as soon as we get that information. Some video, though, that came in this morning. Well, today the Las Vegas City Council will discuss whether HOV lane restrictions should be scaled back. Las Vegas Councilman Stavros Anthony says that he's been flooded with folks calling his office demanding changes to the hours so that more more people can use them who aren't carpooling. You are only allowed to use the lanes if two or more people are in the vehicle. Anthony will ask the city council to pass a resolution asking state transportation authorities to ease the 24 seven restrictions to just a few hours on certain days. Well, check out who showed up at the city council meeting this morning. Vegas Golden Knights, Ryan Reeves. He just received a liquor manufacturer license for 7-5 Brewing. Reeves talked about his new accomplishment. I'm very excited to bring uh, 75 Brewing to the city of Las Vegas downtown, a uh, new city that I call home, so i um, very excited about this opportunity. Well, Reese is a co-founder of 75 Brewery, and it will soon open on Main Street in downtown Las Vegas. Our weather looks pretty toasty through the rest of the week. Our red flag warning for elevated fire danger continues. The steady breezes from the southwest up to about 20 miles per hour this afternoon. Of course, the air is very dry, and that's one of the contributing factors for small brush fires that could spread quickly. Just be careful with cigarette butts again today. 106, the high, that's a little bit of an improvement over where we've been the last week. We'll keep it around average, which is 105 this time of late July through the weekend. Dana, a little less wind by the weekend, and next week, a change, more clouds maybe even a stray storm. All right, that was your 13 Action News Update. You can find more on our website, ktnv.com, and our free mobile app. Have a great day, everyone.